I really don't know how to make a video like this. It just doesn't feel right. But here it is anyway. As soon as I sat down on this chair, I knew that <laughs> this one here is most probably gonna be the hardest video I've ever made emotionally. Me and Mina, we broke up. It happened uh, mid-September and uh, this is also the reason why for uh, the last six weeks Things have been a little bit different on this YouTube channel. I haven't been posting two videos and uh, although I'm still not ready to really talk about it, then I decided to put together this video to tell you exactly what's uh, going on and also to tell you a bit more about my own plans and the future of this channel, future of Wild Viking Travels. As I said, me and Mina, we broke up. Probably for some of you, we were like this perfect couple on YouTube. Yeah, traveling together, living an interesting life. And don't get me wrong, we were. We, we were together for five years and I am really, really grateful for that time. We met in Australia and since then we've traveled half of the world. We've stood on the edge of a active volcano, swam together with sharks, met some wonderful, wonderful people and saw some amazing places. I've spent most of my adult life in this relationship. But like every relationship, ours also had, uh, well, demons. And our biggest demons were trust and uh, the ability to talk about things that really matter. And in the last uh, eight months that we lived in a van in Greece and Turkey, um, whilst being in such small space, a lot of our troubles were pushed aside, not dealt with. And now that we made it back home to Estonia, they just uh, resurfaced uh, and led to us now breaking up, being apart. But leaving all this aside, first off, I don't want to say anything bad about Mina. She's a amazing woman. She she has taught me so much with been through so much and I don't know if I know anyone else with such kind heart. <laughs> you can probably see from the videos as well how she just attracts good people. She gives kindness and kindness finds her the same. So there's so many beautiful, beautiful moments where, where Mina just uh, made, makes those deep connections with other people. The fact that Mina is such a kind and lovely person has definitely made this breakup way harder for me. This breakup definitely came as a surprise for both me and Mina. We had made travel plans together for the next two years and, and planned half of our future. But as it turns out, um, the other half that uh, we hadn't planned, we saw quite differently. And uh, big topics like having a family or what does actually a meaningful relationship mean to us. We had um, 
different opinions, different uh, ways and looking looking at those topics and this is the reason why we decided that we can't go on it's extremely hard but once again i i honestly appreciate every moment of this relationship even the hard times i wouldn't change it for for anything but after a week or so, it all just fell apart. All the way back when we didn't care what they said. People could stare, I didn't give a damn, cause I was being next to you. And uh, moving on from the topic of relationships. So over the last six weeks, I've had a lot of time to think and to figure some things out. Mostly about my own plans, about the plans of this channel. And, and I guess I finally have some answers. First off, while Viking travels, will continue traveling. And good proof of this, tomorrow on Friday, my next journey begins. I will jump in the van and head south once again. Uh, I'll be heading for Spain this time uh, and on the way crossing Latvia, Lithuania, Poland, Germany, probably Switzerland and Austria, France. So what I wanted to ask you guys is that if you have any recommendations, beautiful places or must see things in those countries i would really really appreciate if you could write them in the comments because so far when we were traveling greece and uh, turkey then the most beautiful places were recommended to us on youtube by locals by people who had been there before and it just opened up this new world of traveling for us like we felt like we already had friends in that country before even entering. And probably another thing that's gonna change next year uh, on this travel channel is that uh, I'm gonna do a few more uh, trips further away from Europe. Currently I'm uh, thinking of uh, South America, Africa, Asia. I would gladly pick up a backpack and, and do some amazing shorter journeys all over the world. And as it comes to YouTube itself, there's also a few changes in the videos, I'd say, or, or, or around the videos. First one is that uh, from now on, uh, there's gonna be one video every week. So every Thursday, I would love to have you guys joining me on this journey. It's just amazing to have you traveling together with me. And also, I wanted to let you know that uh, I'll be posting more on uh, Instagram and Facebook. So if you wanna get some more information, see some cool pictures and uh, be a bigger part of, uh, of this journey, then uh, make sure to check out the uh, uh, Wild Viking Travels Facebook and Instagram. Say hello over there. And as a last bit of big news beside Instagram and Facebook, uh, Wild Viking Travels now has a Patreon account. I'm quite new to Patreon, but uh, the small group of people we have over there, I really like it. It's more personal, it's more give and take. We have our newsletter, we have uh, uh, updates of uh, what's going on behind the camera, more info about the future plans. So if you feel like supporting me on this journey, then you can check out the patron. But it's not the must. <laughs> I honestly really appreciate you being here on YouTube, you watching my videos. It makes it all worthwhile to have such wonderful audience. Like every time when I doubt in myself if I'm doing the right thing, if I should be making the videos, if I'm actually giving something back to the world, I just check the comments on, on the YouTube videos and 
I'm just so fortunate to have people like you on this channel. Kind people, supportive people and it really gets me through the hard, hard times. And I guess to sum it all up, first of all I, I, I want to just say, Mina if you're listening, then I wish you nothing but the best. You're a wonderful person and it really makes me sad that it ended the way it did. But I, I will always appreciate the time we spent together, the lessons we learned, the people we turned each other into. Bye. And to everyone else watching, thank you for being here with me in this time. Thank you for traveling with me. Thank you for your support. Um, it's been amazing and uh, like I said before, Wild Viking Travels will continue traveling and I hope that you will join me on this journey. I'll see you next Thursday from somewhere in Europe. Bye.